Yo, what is going on everybody? It is Randizus. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Today we're going to be talking about Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War and its leveling system, how it integrates with Modern Warfare, and most importantly, Warzone. Guys, if you are new or returning and you like the video, hit that subscribe button. We're almost at 1,000 subscribers. And without further ado, let's get right into it. Alright guys, this new system is very convoluted. The blog post Treyarch made is very long, but I recommend you giving it a read. It is very informative. I'm going to summarize each section of it for you with showing it on screen for a bit so you can read it here for yourself as well. The evolution of prestige. Treyarch here is basically saying that they know COD players love the grind of Master Prestige and Level 1000. They know that a lot of OG COD players did not like the leveling system in Modern Warfare and that they listened. They're also letting you keep everything you earned in the initial leveling 255. They saw it work in Modern Warfare, but they're also letting you prestige, kind of, in Black Ops Cold War. The title for this new system is Seasonal Prestige. Seasonal Prestige. So, much like Modern Warfare, everybody will start at level 1 and rank up to level 55. After that, you keep all of your unlocks for the entirety of the future. That's a long time, hopefully. <laughs> but you start a new challenge and begin at seasonal rank one. Think of this like a forced prestige, except unlike previous games, you don't lose all of your unlocks. Much like Modern Warfare, this initial period will be season zero, and up until season one that will be released in December, you will be able to go up three prestiges. Each prestige will be 50 levels and you'll earn blueprints and other rewards for each new prestige you pass. So for each new system that starts, your rank will be reset back down to one. You will again get to keep all of your unlocks, but you will begin leveling up all over again. Very similar to Modern Warfare. Each season will bring you four prestiges, so all the way up to level 200, and by passing each prestige, each 50 levels, you will get new weapon blueprints and other rewards. This will equal a total of 24 prestiges across all six seasons of Black Ops Cold War. Show off your mastery. When you hit level 200 in any given season, you will earn a prestige master title for that season. Your level color will change, which is kind of cool, and you can change your prestige emblem to any emblem from previous Call of Duty games. Now, that part is so cool. Once you reach level 200, you can continue to level up all the way to 1,000. That means in total, you're able to level up 6,000 levels spanning across the entire game. So you will get to get up to six prestige master titles, as well as earning a new reward Ward every 50 levels all the way to level 1000. That means that just by playing the game, you can earn up to four blueprints for free every single season. Season challenges. Another thing that they're keeping from Modern Warfare is seasonal challenges. Previously referred to as officer challenges, every 10 levels you will get a new challenge to complete all the way to level 200. Every challenge will give you a specific calling card slash title, and earning all the calling cards will give you a special prestige master challenge calling card. Prestiging is key. Much like the old games, we are going to have a prestige shop again. Every prestige you pass, you will receive one prestige key. So, like the reward you have the ability to earn up to 20 a season. Now, what you can buy at this point remains pretty much unknown, but they mentioned that you can buy prestige emblems from previous COD, which sounds so freaking cool. Oh my God, I would love to rock the MW2 10th prestige or COD 4 10th prestige or MW2 9th prestige. Any, literally any MW2 prestige system would be awesome. I can't wait for that. Super exciting. And lastly, a new global leveling system starting at season one. This leveling system will not only be brought over to Warzone, but also Modern Warfare. Fair. And because you are sharing blueprints and skins between the games, my guess is it doesn't matter where you play, your level will be the same on every single game. I do believe that you will be able to level up faster in Black Ops Cold War, but that's really not a huge deal. Guys, this is huge. Warzone is officially the main title game and every COD that comes out of it is basically giant DLC, which some people might not like that. I think that it's actually really cool and important for the longevity of the game. This new leveling system is also infinitely better than Modern Warfare's. That one sucked. In summary, every season you will gain 200 main levels, double that of Modern Warfare. You will earn four blueprints every season instead of just one. You will have more customization than Modern Warfare. You will also be able to level up pretty much infinitely every single season. If you make it to level 1000 every season and you need more levels, that's insane. Uh, we're, we're gonna cross that bridge 
when we get to it. And best of all, if you don't want to switch games or you only play Warzone, this new system is still going to apply to you. It is so much better and honestly one of the best things Call of Duty has done in a very, very long time. Well, arguably since the Battle Pass, which is about a year ago. Guys, <laughs> if you have any questions, drop a comment. If you like the video, like the video. If you love the video, subscribe down below and let me know in the comment section what you think of this new system. Peace out.